Hi, it's Matt from Tubby Tarot. Welcome back to another deck review. Today we're going to be looking at the Blue Owl Lenormand. It dates, this particular deck that I've got in front of me dates back to 1970, which is why the little booklet, which is teeny tiny, is so distressed. It's actually naturally old. It doesn't give you a hell of a lot of information on each card, but it will do for beginners, if you can get your hands on one. Um, there we go, first printed in 1970. There it is. Okay, so this was a little deck that I got. The box that it came in was completely trashed. So I honestly, I couldn't use the box. Okay, let's just put that up there. Um, so what I did was I was very lucky to find this beautifully, um, I don't know, what would you call this? Um, embroidered, like a little embroidered. It's a, it's a leather box. It's faux leather. It's not real leather for all those who are vegan and who are now freaking out. This is faux leather. Um, and there's this little embroidered bit in the middle can you see there and it's actually a cigarette box very old as well um, it uh, was made in Austria okay you can just see it was made in Austria and it just clips open like that and of course the inside is covered in this wonderful sort of velour I don't know what you call this stuff like it's the stuff that you get on the top of a um, uh, a billiard table but just it's red so this and the cards fit in here perfectly which i'm so stoked about so that is the little box that i've ended up putting them into now the cards themselves are very small they're the normal size for a lenormand card you can see there okay and this is what the back looks like it's just a little blue owl beautiful beautiful little owl now of course with lenormand you don't read reversals so there's no there's no reversal in this card the card stock, don't forget this is from 1970, and strangely enough, this um this is a this is very good card stock. It's a really, really nice card stock. Okay. Um now I'm going to go through these cards with you one at a time. They are they're not glossy cards, so you can read under bright lights or outside. Now let's just go through this. You're going to see it's very, very traditional. Let me move those out the way. It is very traditional. Um and What's nice about these cards, if you have a look, um, you can see it's got the number. That I don't know. I don't know what that little symbol is. These are these are from Austria. These are from Switzerland. So that must mean something. I am assuming that would be the... Um, I'm not sure. It's the same thing on each card. I really am not sure what that is. But what's nice is it's got this little poem or the little meaning written on the on the actual card. Let me show you. It has that little, that little thing reading. I'm going to quickly read this. Head well, oh, heed well good news from the cavalier. Impassioned views promise good cheer. Sadness that hides veiled in the day, once undistinguished, soon flies away. So that's a good, good news, which we know the writer bringing good news. So it's got these little poems, which are um, terribly Nostradamus, which I think is quite cool. Okay, so let's have a look. That is number one. That is the rider. This is number two. This is the clover. Here's the ship, here's the ship, here's the house, very, very traditional. Here we have the tree, we have the clouds, I like again, you've got the light clouds and the dark clouds, so one side, one side. Here you have the snake, quite like that snake picture, it's very cool. Um, you have the coffin, all right, coffin, you have the bouquet. You have the scythe, very traditional. You have the uh, the, the the birch and the whip, uh, the birch and the and the broom, or the whip, the whip and the broom. Um, you have the, the birds, which here, in this case are owls. Okay, I think the original was owls. That's what I always choose when I have a, a choice. I like to choose owls. Um, you have the child. You have the fox. There are no choices there are no extra cards what you get it what you see is what you get there is the bear that's the stars there are the stalks i'm going quite quickly guys because i have 36 cards to get through if you want to look at them just pause there's the dog there's the tower lovely medieval tower here you have the garden i like that garden there's no fountain but that is the garden here you have the mountain, okay. Here you have the pathway or the, 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 the crossroads. Here you have the mice. I adore this little mice one. Look at that, it's so cute. 
okay naughty little mice here we have the heart oops i'm so sorry here we have the heart here we have the ring here we have the book or the journal here we have the letter okay here we have the man or the gentleman and here we have the lady or the woman see they're facing each other which i like here we have the lilies gilded lilies the sun the moon the key i love this key it's so medieval it's quite scary we have the fish looks almost like a big monster that's going to go and eat that tiny boat we have the anchor and we have the cross and that is the bluebird lenormand i have not done anything no edging or anything to this deck because it is so special to me it's so old um it's like 30 years old am i right 30 70 mm, it's kind of like very old <laughs> okay um it's actually like what 50 years old is it 50 i think it's 50 years old anyway i've got this in my collection i'm very happy with it i hardly ever use it because it's so special to me and it is so old but i'm sure they are they they still print these um there's this there's the blue owl and then there's the blue bird but the blue owl is still in print you can get a copy i'll put a link below Guys, thank you for joining me for another review. You know who I am. I'm Matt from Tubby Tarot. I will be seeing you next Sunday for some more deck reviews.